Hello everyone, I am Aaron Draws, and I am here with another tutorial for you guys. This tutorial I'm going to be showing you how I get this little wiggle effect with um, my animations. It's actually easier than you think, and I just wanted to show you how I was able to achieve this. So first, we're using Animate CC, previously Flash, to create this. To start, we're going to need a drawing. It can be any drawing, but I'm going to start off with this drawing that I drew off camera. Here he is. Alright, so we're going to be taking this static drawing and turning it into a wiggly drawing. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to highlight the frame and press F8 to transfer it into a symbol. You can name the symbol anything, I'm going to name it face. Uh, make sure it is of type graphic, registration really doesn't matter, and all this advanced stuff doesn't matter. And you're going to click OK. So now you've turned this drawing into a symbol. Once you've turned it into a symbol, you're then going to double click to enter the symbol. You can know that you're in the symbol because it says scene one here, and now we're in the symbol called face. Uh, in this symbol, you're going to add six frames with the shortcut F5. And then on frame 4, you're going to add a keyframe with F6. Make sure that it's a keyframe so that the drawing is on both keyframes and not a blank keyframe. Um, if you can't remember any of these shortcuts, you can always just right click on the frame and this little pop-up window will show up that has all of the information that you need to add any of these keyframes. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to go to modify and then shape and then smooth. Um, this is going to straighten out some of your lines and reduce some of the curves. Um, you can do this as many times as you want. The more times you do this, the more wiggle you're going to get. So if I were to go over here to shape smooth again, you would notice that it gets really wonky. Um, so I only like to smooth once, but if you have um, a more scratchy line style, you may be able to get away with more than one smooth and it's still looking okay. So I'm going to go back to one smooth. And the next thing that I do is I go to shape and then optimize. So optimize um, reduces the number of points on a curve to try and make it smoother and reduce um, file size. But it actually wiggles the drawing a little bit, which is exactly what we want. So this little bar here for optimized strength is how many curves it's going to remove. So I like to remove as many as I can before things start breaking, because if you make it too much, things start breaking. So I like to keep it around um, 50 for this drawing. Um, and OK. So then it says that there was originally 374 curves, and now there's 283, and it tells us the production percentage. And that is it. You will notice that the first frame we left alone, and then the second frame has now been slightly altered by our modifications. So we didn't have to redraw this frame to get this wiggle effect. So it's actually quite easy. Now if we go back into our scene and we add more frames, um, I'm going to add six again. Um, just make sure that this, that this symbol is set to loop. If it's not set on loop, it won't work. So if you set it to loop and you press play, and there we go, everything should be working. Now, if you want a perfect loop, I suggest you make the frames on the main scene a multiple of three, or else you may have some issues of one frame for a minute flickering. We've set it to be a new drawing every three frames. I found this to be optimal for the wiggle. Um, I think this looks the best. One is way too fast. Two is also a little bit too fast, and four is too slow. But I know that some animators really don't like working on threes because um, it struggles to make some of the motions look fluid. Um, so if you don't want to use a multiple of three, I would suggest doing it on two because that looks okay. Not as good as three in my opinion, but it's, I think it still works. Um, and that is it guys, a really simple tutorial. Um, I hope this helped. A lot of people were asking how I did this. Um, and it was actually really easy, so I just wanted to share it with you guys. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and like the video. Um, make sure to hit that bell so you receive all notifications. Um, I make a lot of other animations and tutorials and speed paints. Um, I don't really have that consistent of a schedule, but I try to post when I can. Um, thank you everybody for watching. This has been Aaron Draws.